Time now to cross live to the Woolpack in the Dales, where Sharon Marsh has bumped into some of the locals. Good morning to you, Sharon. Good morning. Yes, I've got the lovely Jeff Hordley and Natalie J. Rob with me this morning. Um, we're going to be talking all about their storylines and the gossip from the Dales, as well as the rest of Soapbox. First of all, though, I think I'm going to start with a little look at what you two have been up to on screen. So look. What have you been taking? Just a bit of coke. Remember, this will sort you right out. John, let's go back. Help us! I don't know what you are anymore. Just get out! Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Moira's second best. I know she is. Kane, I love you. I always have. I always will. And when I'm released, I want us to be together. Is everything all right? Yeah, of course it is. So what we're talking? A couple of days, a week? Kane, she's only just got here. Ooh, so there as we go. can see from that, mm. Holly is back. Um, played by the original actress as well, Sophie Powells. Yeah, that's good. So what can you tell us about, about the comeback? Well, I'm very happy to see her, obviously, but I know as a mother, because of what we've been through, that there'll be something underlying there. And problems will be occurring, I'm sure. Yeah, we're, we're both glad that Sophie's back. Yeah. She's such a great, great actress and, and good fun to have on the set and a good friend, so it's, it's yeah. nice to be working with her. The family are back, but of course, last time Sophie was here, we had this fantastic storyline where she did struggle with a heroin addiction. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we just saw in the montage there, um, Kane's a little dubious. He said, how long have you been clean for? What is it, a couple of days, a week? Turns out she's only been clean for three weeks now that's going to be a bit of a shock for Moira isn't well, I think it? she's been on and off with it but yes I'm uh, I'm really surprised I'm really hurt actually I thought that she'd, be, she'd do better than that and ev after everything we've been through but also there's the uh, the boyfriend that turns up as well that we meet who I think is quite charming at first this is the dodgy ex-boyfriend who possibly isn't all that he seems yeah well, he's, he, he, he is a charming fella but mm. Kane's got his radar Kind of on and kind of is 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 aware that something is not right. The fact mm. that she turns up and then a few days later he turns up is like nah. all is not well. Mm, well, exactly. I wanted to ask you about that because we could see Kane's radar was on from that clip there. Mm -hmm. He's got a little bit of a struggle with addiction. Well, not a struggle, but he he understands how destructive it can be, can't he? With his well, obviously because he was brought up by the lovely Shadrach, mm. um, who you know <laughs> alcohol addiction. <laughs> so he is very sensitive when it comes to addiction, and yeah, he's he's aware that the problems it can cause. So therefore, that's why he's very. You know, thinking more about Moira, yeah, that this could be big problems, yeah. Well, I think uh, we can't give too much away about the storyline, but no. he could be right to. But the other thing she's doing is getting into league with Charity. Now, Charity, as we saw from the clip, where she's, she's been back in the soap for a week, trying to get her claws into your man, isn't yeah, well, she? Yeah, well, I've got some claws too. <laughs> Scottish ones. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's probably unfair to put you on the spot, seeing as you are sat next to the beautiful Natalie. But who do you think that Kane should be with, Charity yeah. or Moira? Thanks, <laughs> Um, yeah, this is awkward. Uh, I think that I think that um, I think they should perhaps play a storyline, a, a triangle, which is often seen in soaps. Yeah. But I think you know sometimes the viewers, or people in the show, fans of the show, come and by me and say, you know, you should be with Moira, you should be with Charity. Mm. So I think it'd be a good storyline to play as a long-term thing. Yeah. But, so you um, both. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, yeah, not, I'm, I'm not being drawn upon it. No, I think Moira by night. Because I'm dark. <laughs> Personally, <laughs> I think Kane and Moira are a great match, yeah, and yeah. I think it, she brings a lot of stability to him, and that's what it's I like, like about it. It's like a proper it. marriage, in a way. It's, it's like a proper really marriage. Apart from Auntie Moira, trouble. that she has been snogging Pete, as well, well, he, he snogged me. He snogged me. I just went with it a little bit longer than I should have. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's in trouble when he comes back, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, great. That's nice. I love that. So, um, I'm going to go on to the rest of the soaps now.